If you look at what the UN climate talks are doing now, they're talking about this two degree goal. And I think a lot of the conversation around that is a little delusional, that they've been saying this is the goal for a number of years. Every year they come back and say, okay, if we just get started a few years from now, we can really stay under this goal. Nothing happens. They come back the next year and say, okay, look, if we really get started a few years from now, we can definitely make this. And that's been going on for six or seven years, and it hasn't happened. And in a lot of ways, to make that happen, we would have to take pretty drastic action uh, starting today. So that all sounds pretty bad. But what Joe says is right is that there are a number of steps along the way that we can go, and all of them will be worse than others. And it's possible that at some point, everyone will wake up and find a way to really get at this. And one thing that makes me optimistic is that social change can happen very quickly. And one example I've read about that I thought was great is if you look at attitudes towards smoking, and I like this example because I'm a former smoker. I was a former heavy smoker and managed to quit. Attitudes towards that socially changed very rapidly. You had a point where doctors were recommending that everyone should smoke as a uh, you know, medical cure for things. And that slowly phased out, at least in the US, not globally, but at least in the US. And it happened very quickly. You had this attitudinal change where it went from something that everyone loved to something that people actively shun. And I feel like it's entirely possible that an attitude like that could happen with climate change. And we could have this very rapid shift. It's impossible to pinpoint when that is. It's impossible to say, will that happen before we hit two degrees? Will that happen before we hit three degrees? But it is possible for that to happen. And that's the one thing that sort of makes me more optimistic that at some point we can, everything looks bleak now, but it doesn't always have to look bleak.